Where are you from? I am from Brooklyn, New York. What was your first break? First break. Um, uh, <laughs> um, I think just recently I just did. Um, I was a part of Beverly from a remaster of uh, of it. And uh, what have you been in? I have been in <laughs> um, definitely some a lot of short films at first. Love Sixteen, um, Virgil's Day Off, but um, then I just started. Um, I think it was my first real big movie. And how do you feel about this career? I think uh, the way I'm heading is is good so far. <laughs> And um, how did you decide to become an actor? Um, I think it's because uh, in the very beginning I had I have a stepfather named Chris. He uh, he just, just he gets into these hobbies, which he goes really extremely into these hobbies. I mean, but not just like oh I, every day I'm just gonna take pictures. He got into photography. He actually. He bought all this equipment and he and he started taking pictures of everything every day and uh, he was taking a film class and he asked me to be in it. Uh, <laughs> it was the Virgil's Day Off, he called it. And it was fun. Uh, I, there's one thing I actually enjoyed, so uh, I got signed up to be in this acting class and I think from then on I decided that I have enough experience from this, so I better make this a, uh, a job. <laughs> and how would you describe your specialty or type? Specialty, yes, I will answer that. Okay. <laughs> I have actually an answer to that. Um, every, um, every, <laughs> every um, part I get in, I'm always have a mother who's gone or an abusive relation abusive relationship with my parents. I don't know what that says about me, <laughs> but it's, uh, it's definitely a pattern. <laughs> Who is your favorite actor you look up to? Favorite actor. I got really I'm still really into Bill Murray. Um, Steve uh, Steve Martin. I definitely love the comedians. Um, who else? Uh, I think that's all for now. <laughs> what would your ideal job be? This, I hope. <laughs> I mean, I'll continue doing this for as much as I can, and that's pretty much the job I would like to have. <laughs> Do you consider yourself to be lucky? Yeah, I mean, I started this young. Uh, uh, I have parents that support me, <laughs> and um, I think so far, yeah, I'm pretty lucky. What advantages do you have? My parents, um, I guess, um, advantages, uh, do you mean like personally, like myself? Yeah. Uh, uh, <laughs> You're right. Okay. Um, <laughs> I have short hair, and that gives me post roles from boys and girls. I was <laughs> I was in a um, this uh, school play. Um, what was it? Uh, the Music Man, and I was Winthrop, uh, the boy with the lisp. What does that say about me? <laughs> Would you rather have a car or a diploma? Diploma. In New York, you can take a subway anywhere. <laughs> what does the future look like to you? Uh, I try not to think about it. <laughs> it gets me depressed. <laughs> How do you feel about having children? Um, I'll see what happens. <laughs> what challenges do you feel the world is facing today? Um, people, 
uh, uh, are we gonna, I'm gonna get political here? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> These questions just got from <laughs> where do you come from to, <laughs> uh, I guess, I don't know. <laughs> What are you most grateful for? Most grateful for? I'm most grateful for uh, support, um, uh, being alive, uh, having, having this opportunity. What is your favorite way to communicate? Definitely not speaking. Um, I guess through writing. What is your favorite book, film, and music right now? Book. Uh, I had an answer to this. Um, I'm just going to start with films. <laughs> My favorite film so far is, uh, I got really into these uh, old Italian movies because I was forced to watch them at a young age. Uh, <laughs> uh, so I got into like watching... <laughs> The Bicycle Thief and <laughs> uh, Costa Blanca and uh, a lot of other ones that are extremely depressing, uh, but they're actually really good, um, really, really good uh, way it's filmed, and that's good. <laughs> Guess I got kind of an immune to watching sad films from that. Music? Music. Right, thank you. Um, also, I don't really list, watch, uh, listen to like, most recent pop music. It, it's, n I'm not like purposely hiding my way from that, but I just not really into that sort of thing. Um, <laughs> I actually just listen to <laughs> soundtracks, sadly. Um, like <laughs> like uh, <laughs> um, musicals. Uh, uh, Right now, I really want to watch uh, um, Dear Evan Hansen, and they have the best, not the best, but they have really good uh, music, and <laughs> I actually bought one song from it because I don't have a lot of money, so I'm only listening to Sincerely Me from Dear Evan Hansen, and <laughs> I know all the song, I know all the lyrics to it, but that's the only one song I know, <laughs> sadly. And books? Books. Uh, let's see. Books, 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 books. Uh, I can tell you the genre I like. <laughs> um, I really like what list, uh, reading um, fantasy. That's, I used to get really into fantasy uh, until uh, actually I'm starting to uh, like to read a little more. Um, Nonfiction. I actually, I used to always love reading those. Uh, something for dummies. What are they called? Is that is that what they're called? Because I've always wanted to learn things and just have probably like a useless hobby that I'm really good at, <laughs> so I can just brag about it to other people. <laughs> it just because I just want to <laughs> learn about like <laughs> just have a, one hobby or one. Thing I'm actually really good at that no one else is. <laughs> so I really like nonfiction then too. 